All right, today I got the crossbar kit for the 22 Tucson that I'm going to be installing. I want to thank everybody for uh, helping me reach my goal of a thousand subscribers. I really do appreciate it. I do have a hands-free uh, holder coming, which I did purchase two. I did get this one, but it blocks the camera. I didn't really think it through. And then I did get uh, this other one that hangs from the neck, which is hard to tell where the camera is actually pointing. So I have a, a flexible tripod one coming. So I'll have three, I guess. But uh, let's get this box open. Here's the crossbars in here. Now what I did figure is, uh, I think it's just like the other ones. I don't, did I already do this? I may have. But one is for the rear and one is for the front. So you can see this one's the rear. It has nothing, no ridges along here. And uh, let me get these both open so you can see better. So you can see uh, this one would be the rear, and this would be the the front. It has these uh, wind deflectors. Uh, it's also these have uh, the rears have a bigger space there than this rubber one this out of the way to see. You can see that little rubber piece. The front the ones for the front are shorter because they, they go uh, wider. So that would be how you tell the difference. Uh, these are measurements on them so you can uh, make them even on both sides. So one doesn't stick farther out in the side than the other. You can make sure they're both the same. Or if you want to offset them you can do that. That's up to you. So these are just like this, this is a half turn with a quarter turn with a screwdriver to get these covers off. Quarter turn. That you see the Allen key that's gonna go in there. That comes in the little bag here. I think the next couple videos are gonna have to hold it with my hands because uh, on this Tucson I also got the hitch to do and the mud guards to do so there's uh, all the accessories on this one that they want and then my other tripod camera holder is not coming till tomorrow evening so i uh, still thanks subscribers but uh yeah we're gonna have to wait for the hands free i thought i'd be doing it now but, so let's get these on top of the car let me just set these right on top of the car Spread them out. You see, you can go right on the ridge, the back there. Uh, make sure it's straight. You can measure it to the front and make sure they're both in the same spot. Then we simply tighten this, and the rack will be on. So these are all tightened, and what I noticed was uh, whoever PDI'd this it wasn't me. Didn't take these off. Oh yeah, that's satisfying. All right, so this is on there. We'll get the covers on. So all the covers are the same for all four. Simply place that on there. Get your screwdriver. A little quarter turn there. Apparently, this comes up for uh, I don't know any other attachments. So I'll get the back one on, doing the same thing. Make sure the the ridge parts facing forward. Go. We got the rails on there. If that's your thing, that's all for that video. Uh, my next one, I'm doing the the mud guards on here. So I got uh, those. I'm going to do right now. But I'll probably post it a different day.